Welcome at Octopus. In our tutorial we demonstrate to you how to print pictures using our invisible printer inks. To demonstrate the different editing steps to you we use this sample file. In this original condition it is not possible to print that picture on a printer filled with the invisible inks. To implement the necessary changes on the image file you are required to have an image editing software. We are working here with an old version of Photoshop. To implement the first change, the path and the navigation is picture, adjust and color and saturation. The first adjustment that we implement is to increase the value for the color to 140. After applying this increased value to the picture file, it looks very differently. This adjustment leads to a higher application of the invisible inks during printing that picture file. The second necessary adjustment is to invert the picture into a negative version of the picture file. The navigation in Photoshop is picture, adjust and invert. This adjustment is mainly due to the distribution of the invisible printer inks in the inkjet cartridges inside the printer. And this is how the inverted version of the picture file looks like. Most obvious is that areas that have been in light colors before are in dark colors after the conversion. Background to this is that the black inkjet cartridge inside the printer is filled with the invisible ink that shines white under UV light. So that's why the light parts are printed by the black cartridge. On the opposite that means that areas that have been in dark colors in the original are in white colors or in light colors in the negative file. On these areas no invisible ink at all is printed on. And these areas remain dark when you shine an UV light on the printout. The negative version of the picture file can be sent as a print job to the printer. In our case it's our Epson Workforce 3620 whose cartridges are filled with the invisible inks. Please make sure to set the quality settings for that print on high. The paper used for printing on with the invisible inks should be free from optical brightness. And here you can see the result. Under normal daylight, no surprise, the invisible inks are invisible. This changes when you expose that printout in a dark room to ultraviolet light. In the negative version of the print file, these fonts are in dark color. Now they appear in white as they are printed with the white shining ink from the black cartridge. When pointing the ultraviolet light source to the other parts of the picture or the printout you can see that also the other parts just appear when you point an UV light on the printout. As another example we demonstrate to you here uh, the print of uh, authenticity marking. Therefore the invisible print has been printed first on the paper and the print with the conventional inks has been printed in the second run. If you should have additional questions for additional applications of the invisible printer inks, please do not hesitate to contact us, either by email or use the comment function below the video. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much for watching. If you think our video makes any sense of you and you like it, please hit the uh, like button and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.